Welcome to my channel. Stay black in America. Subscribe. Today it's going to be black in Idaho. Idaho's population is 1,900,000. Black population is 0.9%. Not even 1%. 9,810 people. Home ownership rate 71.5 for Caucasians, 18% for black. Historically black colleges, zero. Black banks, zero. Unemployment rate, 7.8 for the general public, 14.9 for Afro-Americans. Justice system has 7,582 people incarcerated. 3% of that incarcerated, 3% of it Afro-Americans. So the population is only 0.9, but you got 3.0% of the people incarcerated. So you got 227 people incarcerated. Uh, what does... Uh, Idaho produce. It says they produce trout, second in the nation in trout, barley, plums, third in the nation in onion production, uh, and dairy products, cheese, number two in the nation. So we got another situation here whereby unemployment is high, Justice Department is high, and you got um, home ownership below. So you got to employ yourself. You got to become self-employed, man. You got to... Um, you got to uh, find out what the need is there, man, and solve the need. Wherever you solve a problem, you make money. Wherever you uh, take care of a situation, you're going to make money. So uh, you got to look at uh, solving problems. Solving problems make money. Or not, or if somebody hiring you, like, fill the application for hiring me, go to the local office and look at the licenses and see what they cost. Uh, apply for the tax ID, your local tax ID, apply for the federal ID, get insured and bonded. If you're going to have any type of business, whether a mobile business, whether a brick and mortar, which means a store, storefront, something like that, whether you have a bed, bed and breakfast in your house, if you got a house, do something like that, man. And find a need. There's always money in, in, there's always money in real estate, homes, apartments. Everybody's looking at the, 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 do something with the roofs, man. There's always something wrong with the roofs. There's something wrong with the plumbing, the electricity. Something wrong with the people like to paint the interior, the exterior house, the, the, the uh, drywall. Uh, some people like landscape, man. They want to put uh, grass in there. They want to they want to take take out the weeds, do some pruning, plant some flowers, make it look beautiful. Everybody does. Something's always wrong with cars, man. You detail them and clean them. Uh, yeah. Replace batteries, rotate tires, replace flat tires, man. Uh, uh, replace light bulbs, all type of things that people want done. They don't want to actually go to the dealership. Somebody roll up in, in, in a house and roll up in their place of work and do these same these same things they want done and charge them less than to, we're waiting in a line at an auto repair place or, or the dealership. They're willing to pay you uh, less. And you, and you charge less money. I mean, you're beating the competition all the way around. You, the, the, you're going to be uh, called upon a lot, man, because people want to spend less money and save time. So, uh, you know. Got to get on self-employment. That's going to take you that unemployment thing, man. And the house thing, you make enough money, stack enough, stack enough money. You know, a real estate agent more than glad to sell you a property and make that 6%. Everybody looking to make money. People in the house looking to sell it and move on someplace else. So uh, that's just the way it is, man. Uh, most things that, that prohibit you or stop you from getting a home is the down payment and being able to have enough money, let's say, to, to pay your, your settlement and closing costs. When you get all that stuff down, it's pretty easy to get a house, man. The more houses you get, the better. 75% of the people in America became rich, became rich off real estate. Real estate gets more valuable with time. If you buy property for 200000 300000 now, 10, 15 years from now, it's worth 500000 600000 you know, depending, depending on the economy. But houses always go up, they never go down, you know. So that's the way to do it, man. So uh, conservation, I say, man, it's 3%. That's a lot for your population. That's three times your population. So I would say, they say 90% of black people get locked up is always a drug thing. So... Stay away from drugs, man. Don't sell them. Don't use them. Don't associate anybody with them. Don't have them in your car, your, your place. Nothing, man. Stay away from that crap. Let somebody else pile up the charges. Because if black people always be the face of drugs, they don't make no money. Every time it's time for you to go to court, can't, can't afford a real good lawyer. You get a court appointed lawyer. That means you up a creek without a paddle, right? In the sand. Hot sun with no water. So, uh, yeah. That's the way that situation works, man. It's, 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 it's the same all over the United States. So you stay away from those things, man. You work on a... You know, promoting yourself in another kind of way, man, and uh, change the narrative, man. Change the narrative of how things look. This is the greatest country in the world. This is the uh, 15th greatest economy in the world. Uh, with, just, with just black people alone in the United States, the 15th greatest, greatest economy. So you definitely want to, um, you know, stay here. Leave and go on someplace else, man. Not even an option, man. Your, 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 your ancestors spent 400 years in slavery, Reconstruction, all types of Jim Crow laws, civil rights went through. Stay here. Stay here and make it big.
Subscribe to my channel. Stay black in America. Have a nice day.